did you have a chance to play for the Patriots in yeah, Belichick? I, yeah, I did. It's and a what, long story. Well, what what happened? <laughs> did you? It, it just didn't work out, or did you meet on, with Bill? Or no, he. Well, first of all, I got a call um, from William Belichick on my phone, and I'm like, "Who is this?" That's what the call screen. <laughs> that's yeah. what it came up as. Yeah, William like, Belichick. Yes. <laughs> and so I said, you know, you had that. Like, you know, everybody's had that answer the call. And you know you're not in trouble. Well, first of all, you're a grown man. So right, you know right, you're not right. In trouble. <laughs> but your answer, hello? <laughs> and I'm in, the air, I'm in the airport. And so, you know, I'm in the airport heading to Baltimore. And I'm incognito. I got sunglasses on, my hat. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I have my hood on. Hello? <laughs> hey, Steve, it's, uh, it's, it's Bill. And I'm like, this says William. <laughs> <laughs> And so he's talking to me, and uh, we had a conversation, and I, he knew I was going to Baltimore. Had you already verbally committed or dotted line signed? or oh, To what, Baltimore? Yes. Well, Baltimore, f uh, this is age, but they faxed over an offer sheet. Sure. And three, three or four teams faxed over an offer sheet, which was what I knew I was getting on the plane for nothing less than this. Yes. <laughs> so, the, the, <laughs> so that was good. Right. And so we talked, and. Right. Uh, what was interesting is I had to go back because my oldest son was on a recruiting trip. It was a unofficial recruiting trip to Northern Illinois soccer team. So I had to go catch a flight to take him because I, I was already committed. And so I told him we'll go after that. And, but Baltimore was a nice place, and I really enjoyed what they offered me. And, you know, people say, well, why would you not go – to New England, when Super Bowl and all that stuff. Honestly, the what had transpired and where I was at, I just kind of wanted. I just wanted to just kind of go on my gut and and one of the things that you know that Coach Harbaugh had told me, which was cool, was that he said, um, you know, if you can't be yourself, and at the time he said it, it just connected the dots for me. I was like, man, I want to be here. He said, if you can't be yourself, we don't want you here. We only want you to be yourself. Mm -hmm. mm. And obviously, you know, when you get removed from somewhere for being yourself. Right, right. You know, you kind of don't want to more for change. So I was like, you know, I, and, and he worked it out. He at the t uh, Coach Harbaugh at that time wanted to move Mondays to the day off. So I was allowed to fly home right after the game. So if we to played. To Charlotte, where you to, Yeah, where we right. played right. Cleveland. Right. Okay. We played Cleveland from Cleveland, win, lose, or draw. It was a away game. I flew from that city, from that city down to, it was a little FBO in, in, uh, in Monroe. I was flew there. And I got to go home for a away game. So, and I was off on Monday, so I would go back to work on Tuesday or sometimes not mm -hmm. even to Wednesday. So it was more of, he allowed, it was convenience. Yeah, well, I mean, you right. can't beat being with family. I mean, yeah. that, and Plin still be able to continue yeah. your football career. So, right and, here. And, yeah. and I don't know if he would have gave me that opportunity, but that's just where I was, and I enjoyed it, and I had fun. So it's like, no, no, I, I, I yeah. just want to. Some people <laughs> ask me that though. They're like, oh, how could you? Because you know what people winning the Super Bowl is great, right? Haven't won it, been been there, gotten close, but at the same time, man, you win the Super Bowl, lose Super Bowl, the capabilities still do. Right? So, <laughs> you know, for some people, it changes their life for a little bit. You, you still got bills, you know. Yes, you get other perks, but after a while, those perks go away, and they go on to the next Super Bowl champ. So, Yeah, nothing can beat being home, you know, and having uh, daddy there and looking yeah. kids in the face. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.